and welcome back to a new vlog. Okay, so we just got back to Bangkok. We are slightly stressed, ever so slightly stressed. Do you I not... just really needed a wheel on the plane. <laughs> Do not be deceived by how bright this vlogging camera is making it look because it's it is very pitch hot. black and we know it. Basically, oh, yeah. we just got off a flight from Koh Samui. We were meant to land kind of like in the afternoon and it's taken a long time to get through the airport. Then we couldn't find our driver at the hotel but we made it. We're here at the Avani. We went to land at 4 and it's 7, seven. and we've been we, here for 20 minutes. We, we only just got to the hotel. Um, so yeah, we're only here for one night unfortunately which means that is gorgeous. We just, we're basically just basic bitches and we wanted to get a picture and we couldn't get the picture so we're kind of stressed but First world problems. We are yeah, going to Cambodia so in the morning. We have an amazing dinner tonight. I'm gonna to go give you a room tour. The hotel is amazing. I wish we had more time here. I, yeah, me too. It's honestly. divine. Mm -hmm. Wish we had more time here. It's inside a shopping mall, so we're gonna go shopping in Bangkok. We're gonna have an amazing dinner. The staff have been so yeah, nice. They were like, you don't need to check in yet. Just go up, do what yeah, you wanna do. We're like, are you so sure? Funny. So yeah, we approve of this hotel and I'll be coming back to Bangkok at some point. I'm definitely gonna say hello at this view, guys. Yeah. Let's go and actually check into our Let's room. Do it. Let's <laughs> do I'm it. very dumb. This is the rooftop. Well, this is insane, isn't it? Would you look at this? Hello. How insane. Hey guys, so we just checked into our room at the Avani Riverside in Bangkok. Like I said, we have no time here. I so wish we did because this hotel is insane. The service from the minute we, we arrived has just been phenomenal. Literally insane. We were meant to have a bathtub in this room. I'm so sad that we don't. I think that room must have been taken. Um, so the perfect excuse to come back because Matt will love it here. Kind of has Hong Kong vibes. It's like so dreamy, so bougie, such a luxurious hotel. The views are just insane, although it is currently pitch black outside because it just took so long to get here but super impressed with this hotel so clean so nice i've popped this dress on because we are going to go upstairs for dinner apparently the food here is amazing and they have kindly gifted us a nice little dinner so me and emily are going to have a nice dinner and then i'm meeting my friend from bangkok who i met seven years ago in london so this is exciting this is a bathroom it's just nice and compact this is a bed which we literally had like a few hours to sleep in here and then the view i'll just pop a little clip over that i took earlier literally the only light we had um but wow it's pretty phenomenal right phenomenal phenomenal Insane. Gorgeous. Oh yeah, I like you like that. What are we gonna eat? This restaurant is insane. Oh, that's me. Thank you so much. Gosh, this is amazing. Thank you. Thank you. Cheers. Oh, I love Brazilian bread. Have you ever had it? Yeah, yeah. I had it at the airport in Brazil. So good. So we've ordered Brazilian bread. You're probably wondering why, because we're not in Brazil, but the menu takes inspiration from Brazil and also tiger prawns. Oh my goodness. Jenga or wagyu slice. Spaghetti. Thank you so much. Thank you. Long time yeah. we know since. Four years already. And when I first met him, he couldn't speak a word of English. <laughs> and now, I'm so shy. he's an English teacher. Well, you look good. 
My diva. Thank you. Yeah, you also know that one. My diva. <laughs> it's Top's first time up here, so he has to get a panorama of it. Bangkok, you're beautiful. And this bar is stunning as well. So we have landed in Cambodia. I'm gonna give you a quick room tour that I just filmed because there's loads of stuff in my room. I just checked in to a Navani hotel. Oh, here she is. Oh, hello. I need you to help me fasten my dress up, please. So we just landed. We're in separate rooms this time. Oh, hey. Um, this is a dress I wore last night, but no one on this trip has seen it yet. Um, we just landed in Siem Reap. Is that how you pronounce it? Yeah, I'm pretty sure. In Cambodia. And um, this is the most amazing room ever. And we're just going to go have some breakfast. So let me quickly show you the room tour. And then we'll go for some breakfast. So we're here on a press trip with Avani Hotels. And we're super excited to be hosted here. Ta-da. So gorgeous. let's go get some breakfast after showing you this room tour. So this is my room. How gorgeous is the design of this? How cute is this? Oh with a little present. Gorgeous, oh wow. Oh yay, the beach bag that I had on my last trip. They have it in here. So I can use that. Gorgeous little bathroom. How stunning is this? This shower is absolutely divine. And then this is a little garden view. Cute little welcome snack. How nice is that? Just walking to breakfast. This is amazing. Just having a little tour of the hotel on the way to breakfast. Oh my goodness, how stunning is this? Look at this bar, how divine. Just having a little look outside. It's beautiful. Mmm, they got oatmeal and bran. Yeah. And look at this fruit bowl and Emily got pancakes, but we're gonna share. Yeah, cool. And look at this view. So breakfast was absolutely amazing. And now I've just put this little dress on and I'm gonna go for a wander around the hotel with Emily. And we have a special lunch today apparently, but we're also going to relax by the pool, which I'm so excited for. changed into this is so hot we've just been chilling by the pool and now we just had a lunch delivery i'm so excited to eat this i've gone for rice with an egg on top emily went for a burger look at this view we've just had the nicest swim in here i can't believe how hot it is it's way hotter than thailand was and we're just waiting on some mango sticky rice gosh the mango sticky rice came and some fresh watermelon juice so it's gone from the most insane hottest day still super hot but now we've got a little rain cloud look at that so we are just walking to the gym. Let's go and explore this jungle gym.
Ah, so today was so nice. It was so nice to just have a day to chill because our Asia trip has been quite crazy. I'll leave links below to my Thailand vlogs, which have both gone live now. Just wearing this and heading for some dinner now. So excited to eat dinner tonight because lunch was amazing, breakfast was amazing. We were gonna go out and explore, but then it was raining, so I had a great gym session instead. Feel good, I'm really excited for tomorrow as well. But also, excited to eat tonight. I'm gonna have some authentic food, see what's on the menu. Wearing this dress and oiled my body up with this neon So we got shrimp, which looks insane, calamari, chicken wings, and these like taco things. How amazing. By the way, Josie's here now. Hey. We're on like a group press trip now. I'm still with this one. She's not bored of me a week on. We're doing well. We're still here. Yeah. Pad Thai. With a side of rice. Yep. <laughs> and I got steamed rice. Absolutely. Some beef. Give it a little wobble. Woo Looks yummy. Second mango ziki rice of the day. I just got into my room and the hotel have left me. I've just nibbled these two. Cookies by my bed. <laughs> that is such a nice little top. Hey guys, from me and my friend, I have a spot. Fantastic. So, I had such a nice sleep last night. This morning, we are very lucky. The hotel have organized a little breakfast by the pool, which is just divine. I'm so excited. Look how beautiful this looks. Pineapple juice, please. Pineapple juice. Look at this breakfast set up this morning. I am shook. <gasps> Look at that. This is heaven. We got some eggs. We got some fruit. I'm so excited for this. We got some toast. We got some oats. Yum. Morning again, guys. So we had two breakfasts because we went and sat some of the others on the trip and had a breakfast downstairs. Oh my god, the food here is so good. Now we're going out of the resort, out of the hotel to explore. Look at my dress, I love it. I'm a little bit obsessed, it's gonna be too hot to be honest. I feel like it's just that kind of weather where you just need to be naked. It's like 9 a.m. and it's already like so humid. So let's go see what Cambodia has for us. We're about to do an ethical jewelry workshop. It's a social enterprise and it offers apprenticeships and pursuing design for young, disadvantaged, and disabled Cambodians. How cool is that? And they use recycled bullet casting, silver, and gemstones. So, this is meant to be amazing. Transforming neg negative metal into positive jewelry. How nice is that? Let's go. We got a lot of stamps, kind of stamps. So the last one is the letter, the small case and the big case. And the orange one is very tiny letter. Thank you. Oh, I did a shot. That was good. Can I get a disc, please? Yeah. Thank you. Oh my goodness, this is what we made. This one's mine.
So we just did the jewelry making class. I made a little pendant, and now we're going to the so Hey, back for lunch. Are you hungry? This way, yeah. Let's see. Around the place at the moment with 20 hired staff and 11 trainees. The trainees are all coming either from orphanage, sleep kid shelter, sex trafficking shelter, from the uh, uh, organization they do community work. So all kind of organizations take care of children until a certain age. And we do the reintegration into real life. In the backyard we have the school for the theoretical lesson, the working skills and life skills. The practical part is training on the job. We have a 16 months program, 12 months they get trained here, after 12 months they move on to a four month internship with a partner place here in Siemrit. So, Ananda is one of the places they take them in for another uh, four months. After 16 months we help them to find a job and a place to stay. Oh, spring rolls, my first spring rolls in Cambodia. was amazing. I'll tell you about that soon, but now, getting on a tuk -tuk. I'm so excited. Um, we're just on a tuk -tuk at the Hotel Kangol, guys. We're having a little tour of the local area. Literally so cool. It's actually Emily's first ever tuk tuk place. Ever. 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 Some amazing restaurants and bars in Cambodia. There's not very many tourists here at all. We're back at the hotel and wearing this and rewiring it. I have my laptop out because we decided it would be a good idea, a cute idea, to make a little breed and a drink. We got tea <laughs> um, up on the terrace. So oh, hey, um, you can hear drilling behind me. They're actually building a spa for the hotel. That's cool. I'm just gonna sit here and have a little drink. House in spa. How gorgeous is that? Oh. <gasps> This is stunning. Good morning guys, it's 4am in the Big Brother house in the Avani room. I don't know why I'm so sprightly because I'm very tired. I am heading to the temples. I'm heading to something super, super, super famous in Cambodia. And I'm so excited to take you with me. And we're apparently going to see the sunrise, so let's see. We're gonna get a car there now, so can't wait to take you. So oh, here we are. I don't know, why do we go? Oh. I've got my dressing gown on to cover myself up because of respect. Um, and yeah, basically, so it's crazy. I didn't think this many people would be here, but this is like tourist central, so it's called Angle Walk. And it's spelled A N K G O R, Angle. So Angle Walk. Yeah. I pronounced everything wrong. And you get a tour guide. The hotel has kindly organised a tour guide for our group. Yeah. And they drive you to pick up your little tickets. And you all stand on. in a little ticket office at literally half past four in the morning. And then you drive a bit further and now at the temples. Apparently these are one of the wonders of the world, but like an ancient wonder of the world. Yeah, apparently this is the biggest temple in the world. And Tomb Raider was filmed here apparently. Okay. Well, it's definitely very big, so I've definitely got my steps in this morning. Just walking across here. I also had an hour's sleep, so excuse me if I sound a bit grumpy. Um, I'm just thinking about breakfast. Mm. But yeah, we're watching the sunrise, so this is going to be once in a lifetime.
casual hole. Look at that little hole, see? I'm so happy actually. Living its best life. You are a poser. Oh my god, I love you. Oh my god, as if he sat down in front of Angkor Wat. You can see what's up the monkey, Chelly. Chelly, yeah. The monkey sit on the top here. Oh, yeah, they're on the top Oh, he wants some food. Hello! Nay. Nay. Yeah, you know, Angkor, Angkor from the sand strip of the Nagara mean the city. And also, what mean the Buddhist monastery? And what I could spell W A T or V A T mean the Buddhist monastery. Right. That monkey that you just saw is so mischievous. Sorry, I'm just trying to hold my feet up. It took my back. Its little claw hand just came and took my back. Um, and the guide had to like fight it off, kind of, to get my back back. But it's here. And now we found some more monkeys. <gasps> they're so cute, even though they're cheeky and they still stole my bag. <gasps> they're kissing! Not so they move lies on the head. <laughs> This is their morning grooming routine. <laughs> Just at the hairdresser. Oh, what is he stealing? Oh, What's that one stolen? <laughs> oh wow, they're packing that. This is actually a floating bridge. And we walked down this one, it was pitch black. And look how beautiful this is now. This is insane. And then you have the temples behind. Yeah. I'm just avoiding stray animals, stray dogs. I didn't get the vaccination for that. I, I know I did. It being close stray dogs contact. everywhere. Look, another one. <gasps> Guys, we don't want to get rabies. Um, the monkeys were climbing over everyone. Obviously, you should not let monkeys do that. We're just walking out. Cute little market stall. Just having a look around. Now we are just at the temple from Tomb Raider. I'm just getting soul stuff. Oh, I'm just getting soul stuff. Oh, I said I'm so cute. Oh, look. No thanks. No thank you. I don't have any money. No thank you. It makes me sad because I think obviously the people here want to sell stuff and I always try and buy stuff from the local communities. Like I want to just go and give them money. We don't actually have any cash on us because if I had cash on me right now I would just give them the cash and just be like, you know, enjoy it. Like, it the kids are so sweet. And the kids are so sweet it. and they speak such good so English. Good. And it's not that I'm being rude, but we had like one guy harassing us being like, you're so cute. Then a little kid trying to sell us and then a woman trying to sell us. And there's a guy, no, but it just doesn't feel right because there's a group of kids over there and there's a guy and the guy is sending each kid over to us one after a time. Yeah, and it's like, really bad. It's That's like probably feel, trafficking. It just man. doesn't feel right. I wish I could give the children, not the man, some kind of money to help them, but is it going to help them? Or are they just going to give it to I feel like I'm not clued up enough on situations like this. It's a shame because we actually wanted to go shopping over there, but we just got harassed, so we've come back. We're back at the hotel. What time is it? It's breakfast time. It breakfast time. Breakfast. It is 9am. It is 9am. We've been up since 4. Slept for an hour. But we are so excited for this breakfast. I think this is one of the best hotel breakfasts. So nice.
So that was incredible going to see the temple. Then we did a bit of shopping. It was amazing. I've just been for a little workout. So good to just sweat out for 25 minutes. We're having a little final lunch at a place called Scribe. And then we have a flight to Laos. <laughs> she just asked if I wanted her to fall in the, the lake for my vlog. It's not even a lake, is it? No. Um, also, all my clothes are packed, so I don't want to. Do I like these trousers. Thank you. They're from Nasty Gal. I'll link it below. <laughs> <laughs> um, oh, why? <laughs> guys, we are leaving Cambodia now. That was short but sweet. Nice little press trip with Ivani. It was just saying our favourite thing <laughs> on this trip was the breakfast. And also, obviously, the sunrise this morning, but food wise, the breakfast at this hotel was banging, wasn't it? It was epic. It was epic. Epic. So, yeah, I would highly recommend this hotel. Can I just say, the pancakes were this. Thick. They're amazing, weren't they? They were that thick. I still love these every day. They're not stodgy. They're no. not stodgy, the perfect level. So yeah, the hotel's been amazing, the staff have been amazing. Bangkok was amazing, but I need to go back because I obviously did not have enough time there. Probably one of the nicest hotels I've stayed at in a long time. In terms of service, food, everything, and this place was just divine. So I need to come back to Cambodia. I know there's a lot more things I need to tick off. Um, and now we are getting on a flight to Laos, which I probably pronounced wrong. But let's go, and I will see you guys for another vlog on Friday and a sit-down video on Sunday. Come say hi on Instagram at mshalax. Big love.